So I want to welcome you to a new video. So in this video we are going to be doing a workout and then after we're going to do a social experiment. Now as you saw in the title, yes we've done hugs but in this video we are now going to be doing free kisses. Before this video starts I want to talk to you guys about something and that is goal setting because a lot of you guys message me and go look I get demotivated not only in the gym but in life in general so what i'm going to advise you all is just sit down at the start of the week for example on a sunday yeah just sit down write your goals for the week your goals can be that this week you are going to work out five days a week if it means write it down on your phone or write it down on a board or whatever so you know that you are going to accomplish them goals because a lot of us we were just go through the week and don't have no goals you know we're just gonna go through the motions of things and that is something that you do not want to happen so for example myself I write down that okay I'm gonna work out five times this week I'm gonna record a video or this many hours in the day I'm gonna give my time to my clients so by doing that you know that these are your goals for your week because if you don't have no goals in life yeah, you don't have no plan of action you are going to become a plan of someone else's life so it doesn't matter how old you are i want you guys to start writing down your goals write it down literally just sit down on sunday yeah it comes like eight o'clock nine o'clock or whatever on a sunday you're at home watching tv just go upstairs in your room write your goals for that week and believe me you're going to get so much further in life by doing that so i'm here getting back to all of my clients so if any of you guys want to get shredded in 90 days and want to work with me make sure to drop me an email and i'll give you the complete details how we can work together and get you shredded in 90 days every single month you're going to be receiving a new workout and diet plan and by the end of the 90 days you are going to be shredded it doesn't matter if you or someone who works out at home or if you work out at home and you're a vegan for example no problem at all I will create your program which will drop your body fat you will get a lean and muscular physique in them 90 days so make sure to drop me an email and I'll give you the complete details so before this video starts make sure to click the like button make sure to follow me on my Instagram and my snapchat and if you're new to the channel make sure to click that red button below and subscribe so let's begin this video let's get into the gym i'm gonna go and train arms and then after i'm gonna show you the social experiment video and let's do it so i'm gonna be taking you through this arm workout now when you are training your arms it's entirely up to you what you want to start on do you want to start on your triceps or do you want to start on your biceps now i find that if you start on your triceps first you get a lot better pump on your biceps so that's one of the reasons why I will usually start on my triceps but make sure any tricep exercise you're doing make sure your form always comes first in fact your form always comes first on every exercise so make sure you're getting that full stretch in your triceps and you are going up and getting a good squeeze that is a major key when you're doing any exercise in the gym. It doesn't matter if you're doing a bench press, squat or whatever, your form always comes first. So after I completed my triceps, I moved on to my biceps. Now, again, form, I can't stress more, man. Like your form always comes first. So get a good stretch down, up, squeeze. And when I do my dumbbell curls, I'll get a little bit of twist at the top as well. I can get a really good squeeze that way. So give it a go. Then I moved on to the barbell curls and I've said it in my previous videos but if you are someone who has a wrist pain I'll recommend you to do your barbell curls on the Z bar or the EZ bar or whatever you want to call it. So I will do my barbell curls all the time on the Z bar. Just a straight bar puts too much stress on my wrist. And then after I moved on to some hammer curls, you can do your hammer curls on the cables with the rope. but. For this workout, I did it simply with the dumbbells. So finally, I finished off with some cable curls and the cables is really good when training your arms because there's always gonna be constant tension on your arms when doing any exercise with the cables. So make sure when you're doing your cable curls, take a few steps back, make sure you get a nice stretch and come up and squeeze. Now, I'm going to be talking over this social experiment. So what? happened was that i dressed up as a cleaner and no one literally no one 
was giving me kisses or no one was giving me hugs or whatever they'll literally maybe give a quick look and walk past now the reason why i'm doing a voiceover is because i'm going to explain in a minute what exactly happened so it was pretty embarrassing and look i just got out of my comfort zone like look let's just do it let's make this happen and no one was giving no kisses no hugs they were just walking past probably look at me laugh with their wife or their girlfriend or whoever they're with and walk past then i thought you know what now it's time to reveal the aesthetics and literally people were coming they were giving like hugs, they were giving kisses and everyone literally was just getting involved. Who would look at the sign, they were getting involved, they are taking pictures and it was so sick. Yeah, I know it took some confidence for me to do this but I just did it and even people would want to give me money. I go look, it's free. This girl was just touching abs like she was just going crazy. Now what happened was that this person's daughter came up to me and gave me a kiss on the cheek. He didn't like it. He did not like it, so he came up to me and he goes, look, why have you done that? And I go, look, it was up to her, this guy. And then he called the police, yeah? They came up to me Yo. and I just had to cancel the video and we stopped. So it's time for me to speak to you all. Now, I think I probably made it worse when the police car came I turned around and put the free kisses sign to them probably made it a little bit worse but look if you put a sign or if I put a sign saying whatever the hell I want then it's up to whoever looks at the sign to react like I put signs before like free hugs it's entirely up to that person it's not like I'm going up to a person yo give me a kiss or give me a hug no and the police came up to me and said someone's husband complained that you are giving free kisses and I'm like look it's up to them like I'm here I can do whatever the hell I want I'm not going up to that person yo yo give me a kiss give me a kiss no like it's up to them if they want to give me a kiss they give me a kiss if they don't want to give me a kiss okay like don't give me a kiss then finally I just got put off and I said you know what screw this video like i just got in a bad mood and when i get like in a bad mood or when i'm just not feeling the video i just get put off and i go look screw this i'm out of here so that's what happened like the reactions were insane like everyone is coming people are coming like giving kisses and all sorts and then someone decides to take things to the next level and just spoil it i go you know what screw this i'm out i might come back here I might even just do something more better than that. Kisses, okay, cool, we've done that. Hugs, we've done that. I might just do something more like, yeah, I don't know. If you think of something that you want me to do, leave a comment section below and I'll happily do it. Like, yeah, YOLO. Now, something that I want every single one of you to take away from all these social experiments that I'm doing is I want you all to treat everyone the same. It doesn't matter how many followers you have on Instagram, how much money you have, how fat you are, how skinny you are, that doesn't mean anything because everyone on this world is equal and I don't care how much money you have, how ripped you are, how fat you are, that doesn't mean anything or how much subscribers on YouTube or followers on Instagram, like that's how everyone sees people nowadays for who they are. That's why I'm doing these social experiments just to show you all that look this is how this world is but I don't want you to be like that. So in the future if you want to see any type of social experiments or videos that people can actually take something away from make sure to leave a comment in the section below and I will happily make a video on that. So if you like this video make sure to leave a like on the video. I wanted to get this video out there. I didn't want to just waste the footage. I thought hey look I'm still going to upload this and I'm going to explain to everyone what exactly happened. If you're new to the channel make sure to click that red button below and subscribe and if any of you guys want to get shredded in 90 days and want to work with me make sure to drop me an email and i'll give you the complete details how we can work together and get you shredded in 90 days every single month you're going to be receiving a new workout and diet plan and you are not going to have no excuse by the end of it not to be shredded you know people have lost so much weight they've got ripped after the 90 day shredding plan and i've actually used it on myself and that's how i transformed my physique this year and I've actually got a transformation video and I'm going to link that in the description below so you all can check it out. So make sure to follow me on my Instagram and my Snapchat and I shall see you all in the next video. Peace.